Welcome back to the contestant battle rebooted, last time, the evil demons lost the challenge, so they are up for elimination. Let's start the elimination right now. Hello evil demons, welcome to the elimination area. How does it feel to be here? A bit weird honestly. Maybe it's because it's been a long time since I last competed. I can understand that Kimberly. I'm sure once you start getting put up for elimination more often, that weird feeling will go away. Anyway, we received 469 votes, with 278 likes and 191 dislikes. That's more than double of last time, thank you viewers for voting. Let's reveal the prize votes. Levi and Priscilla, you two got the most likes, so both of you win the prize. Priscilla, you get an immunity token, and Levi, you get a win token. Oh wow, I can't believe I actually won the prize. Yeah, I'm surprised that I also won the prize. Now, before we reveal the dislikes, Levi, Priscilla, and Zach, would any of you three like to use your tokens? Nope. No. I'll pass on using mine. Alright then, for this elimination, I have 15 oranges to give out. If you get an orange, you're safe. But if you don't get one, you're eliminated. Amber, Isaiah, Zara, and Heather received immunity, so they are safe. Nice. Eric, you received the least amount of votes with only 11 votes, so you're safe. Yes, I'm safe. Ashley and Zach, you two are safe with 12 votes each. Yay. Awesome. Levi and Kimberly, both of you are safe with 13 and 14 votes. That's good to hear. Ivy, Erica, and Juan, you three are safe with 15 votes each. Now only Priscilla, Garrick, Evil Erica and Brandon are left. And with 16 votes, Priscilla is the next one safe. A few. I got a bit worried there. Brandon, you managed to receive 17 votes. Which means you're safe. Ha ha, I knew I was gonna be safe. Which means it's now down to evil Erica and Garrick. One of you will be safe, while the other one will be eliminated. Let's display the votes. So, Garrick is the last one safe with 20 votes. Oh thank gosh. That was way too intense. And Evil Erica, with 31 votes, you have been eliminated. What? Are you serious? How in the world did I lose to this bunch of losers? Let's be honest Evil Erica, you really should have seen this coming. If you weren't acting like this, people would have liked you more. Shut up Brandon, you yourself aren't much of a saint either. Maybe. But at least I don't go around calling people useless just because of a stupid challenge. Anyways, Evil Erica, it's time for you to go. Goodbye. Fine, eliminate me all you want. Just know that when I see you again, I will get my revenge on all of you. Ooh, revenge, totally haven't heard that one before. Now, with Evil Erica gone, we can get started with the next challenge. The next challenge is to eat 100 cakes. All of your team members must eat these cakes for your team to qualify. If even one person from your team drops out, the entire team loses. The first team to eat all 100 cakes will win the challenge. 
and immunity will go to the three people on the losing team who eat the most cakes. And with that said, let's get started. Oh wow, that is a lot of cake for us to eat. I know, it is a bit surprising that our entire team has to eat these cakes, let alone the fact that our team will lose if one of us drops out. I honestly think it's a bit harsh to disqualify the entire team just because one person refused to participate. Same, but I understand why he did that. He wants to make sure everyone participates and not slack off. I guess that makes a bit of sense. Hey, not to be rude and interrupt your conversation, but please start eating those cakes so we don't lose the challenge. Ugh, I really don't understand the point of this challenge. What do you mean Brandon? I mean, all that we're doing is eating cake. I don't know why something like this needs to be a challenge. I think Donovan just likes to do simple challenges like this. Especially since it can be easier for us to handle. I guess, but I still think this challenge wasn't necessary to do. But it's whatever I guess. Alright then, now let's get back to the challenge. Sure I guess. So far, the great gangsters has a slight lead with 20 cakes, while the evil demons has only eaten 19 cakes. Remember guys, you must eat all 100 cakes for your team to win. Whoa, Eric, you might want to slow down a bit. You don't want to eat too many cakes at once. No way, I am not going to slow down. I need to eat as many cakes as I can so our team doesn't lose a game. I understand that. I'm just asking you to slow down a bit so you don't get yourself sick. Trust me Priscilla, I'll be perfectly fine. If you say so. Hey Thomas, do you think that your team might have a chance of beating my team? Maybe, even though my team has a slight lead against your team, I saw how fast your teammate Eric is eating those cakes. Yeah, Eric seems really determined to help my team win this challenge. Or maybe he's trying hard to show that he is not a complete whip. Ericina, why did you say that? Because it's true. Eric has always been a complete pansy for as long as I have known him. Well maybe if you weren't being such a bully to him, he wouldn't have to be as soft around you. Yes yeah, sir, go ahead and believe what you want. Eric will never be able to last longer than me because he's a little pansy. We'll see who will be the little pansy when she gets eliminated bully. Yeah, I agree. Hey, Donovan. Oh, hey Ashley, what's up? I wanted to ask you, how many cakes have both of our teams eaten? Well, currently the great gangsters have eaten 57 cakes, while your team the evil demons has eaten 53 cakes. Both teams are over 50% done with the challenge. Alright, that's all I wanted to know, thank you. You're welcome. Oh wow, both teams are now tied at 90 cakes eaten. So guys, the first team to eat their last 10 cakes wins the challenge. Oh crap. Did you hear that Priscilla? Yeah, let's hurry and eat the cakes quickly. Huh? I just realized that I haven't eaten a single cake yet. Better start eating one now to help my team win. There, that's better. Hey Zara, do you know if there is any cakes that Arm hasn't finished yet? Actually, I think there are still two slices of clay left over there. Alright, thanks. Alright, time to eat these cakes and win the challenge for my team. Time's up everyone. The challenge is over. Wait what? That's right. Since the great gangsters ate all 100 of their cakes first, they win the challenge. Which means the evil demons are up for elimination for the second time in a row. Oh, wow. I can't believe our team managed to win again. I know, right? It feels good to hear that we're on a winning streak. Before we show the voting screen, here are the highest people who ate the most cakes on each team. Since Eric, PC Guy, and Davion ate the most cakes, they will each receive tokens. And as for immunity, since Eric, Zach, and Priscilla ate the most cakes on their team, they will receive immunity from elimination. Yay, I'm glad that I got immunity from elimination this episode. Honestly, I'm not really mad that I don't have immunity, especially since I already won immunity last time. Alright viewers, 
You know what to do, vote for any of these characters that you think deserves a prize, or to be eliminated. Voting ends 84 hours after this video's release. And with that said, thank you guys for watching this episode of the Contestant Battle Rebooted. Make sure you subscribe to this channel to stay tuned for future episodes and any other content I might make. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next episode.